Since that day you saved my life. I have presumed I knew you. But now, a thousand letters from your father go unopened, yet one scribble from your sister changes everything. I didn't even know you had a sister. We are broke, old pal. We can't afford a passage back to your old world, back to your family. Not unless you suddenly remembered what work is. Dynamite fishing? You're serious? <laughs> well, the village north is always short on food. Remember when we escaped the pits back when? Still some dynamite. Must be plenty of fish in this bay. In the old days, we'd have done this in our sleep. Here it is. Just get plenty of distance on the throw. I owe my life to you. You go. I follow. Until I decide the debt is paid. Conquer your mind. Conquer the world. told me you had a sister. What else haven't you told me about? You couldn't hit a cow's ass with a sitar. for opportunity. After all, it's not TNT the locals are short of. <laughs> fish. All the blistered fish they could ever want. When are you layabouts going to get a job? Don't expect success sitting on your heels. That burnt reek! Ugh. Hand over whatever it is and I'll help you get rid of it. Here are your tickets. Hurry, drifters. The boat is leaving soon, and nobody wants you to miss it. So, this is it. We're leaving paradise behind. You never talked much about family and the like. But you're dead serious about this, aren't you? No matter. I made a vow to defend you. And I don't break an oath. Even if a blind man could see you leap into the deepest pit of dung. I have never asked anything of you, Firstborn. Not when you stole away a tiptoe, leaving the family burden at your little sister's door. Our father is accused of high treason. 
dare you to believe it? Will you now stand I by? I am terrifying. Gentle father is endungeoned. It must kill him. Please come home. We need you. Is it really you, dearest sibling? I never dared hope you'd return. Do you remember Bright Sands? Of course you do. We loved it here. It's changed now. The Royal Council support Uncle Edvard. Father barely cold, and he's pulling everything down. Those houses. You never said how wealthy you were. <laughs> Why were we selling fish and sleeping in barns? Never told your friend of good and sons. There is much to be said, but not now. Dear father's funeral begins. Where have you been? Without you brats, we'll never be done with this obligation. Looks like death claimed the wrong brother. No matter, so few are here, when they are the few he loved most. Nobody likes a traitor, let alone his tainted offspring. Better make yourself scarce. We shall, dear sibling, for now. I have acquired a small island with the last of my funds, and passage for all still loyal to father. Together, we shall clear his name, or die trying. Your sister reminds me of you. Must mean new adventures await, old pal. This is it. Ditchwater. End of the world. I hope you like it quiet. You never told me you had a sister. What else haven't you told me about? What? Still here? Establishing a rival company on that disheveled island? Let Uncle Edvard scoff. A modest island, yes, but if you're at all like father, you'll look beyond appearances. We must shelter the good, loyal people who have shown solidarity with our family. We need every hand we can get if we are to expunge this debris.
I checked the manifests. Not all our facilities are able to deliver the goods they produce. Please correct the situation. You reached a new milestone. Appreciate your help, however overdue. My basket is flowing over. Do you remain here out of spite? Or is this some futile attempt at competition? As you are so desperate to appear responsible, you'll be pleased to hear the cost of that fantastical funeral falls to you. Miserly, uncharitable dastard, picking and choosing what he inherits. Everything you've built so far consumed wood. We'll be needing more of it to continue. See what slander Edvard Prince and Bright Sands! Samuel's child, is it? Thank heavens! I am so ashamed of every... He twists every article in his favor at our and father's expense. wouldn't have wanted us to sit on our hands while our one prospect was in such a state. 
So let's gather our townsfolk and ask them to spruce the place up. is eased. Now we have others for company, sibling. It's been a hard day of labor for us all. We should cater to our tired, hungry people. Timber, very good. I'll try not to think of the coffin. You restore a grain of my trust in humanity, eldest. Why not one, but several prospects in quick succession? appreciate your help. 
however overdue. It's missing. Better check on my little ones. Thank you. 